Ever wondered who the guardian of the English language might be? The one who dedicated their life to its meticulous study and refinement? Journey with us back to the Victorian era, a time of intellectual curiosity, great change. This is the saga of a man born on the 10th of March, a man who would leave an undeniable mark on the written word. His name, Henry Watson Fowler. Born as the world was beginning to appreciate the power of words, Fowler was a child of his time, and his destiny was to become an influential figure in the world of linguistics. His odyssey began in the hallowed halls of Oxford University, diving deep into the realms of classical languages and literature. Following his studies, he shared his knowledge as a schoolmaster, shaping young minds. But his true destiny was yet to reveal itself. A turn of fate saw Fowler and his brother set off on a linguistic adventure, one that would echo through the annals of English language, influencing generations of writers, editors, and language enthusiasts. This is the tale of the remarkable Henry Watson Fowler, whose impact resonates to this day. Fowler's fascinating journey to linguistic prominence began amidst the hallowed halls of Oxford University, where an amusing incident involving a Latin text first revealed his gift for classical languages and literature. This was not just an education, but a forge where Fowler honed his skills to a razor's edge. Fowler, along with his equally erudite brother, Francis George Fowler, embarked on a mission that would send ripples through the realm of the English language. The year 1906 marked a milestone. The Fowler brothers published The King's English. This masterpiece was more than just a guide. It was like a lighthouse in a storm for confused writers, providing clarity and effectiveness in writing. The brothers' keen eye for detail and their characteristic wit, often evidenced in their humorous annotations in the margins of their work through the pages of this comprehensive work. The King's English not only propelled Fowler to the status of a leading authority on English usage and style, but also set a towering benchmark for future writers, and it was their meticulous attention to detail and their never-fading wit that made the King's English a beloved resource for writers seeking clarity, precision, and a touch of brilliance in their prose. Fowler's magnum opus, A Dictionary of Modern English Usage, published in 1926, is no ordinary dictionary. It serves as a guide, a guru, a beacon of light for those sailing the complex oceans of the English language. It uniquely combines wit, wisdom, and a dash of sass to challenge the accepted norms and establish fresh standards for English usage. This all-encompassing guide condenses Fowler's extensive knowledge and expertise into a single, easy-to-access volume. From grammar and syntax to idiom and diction, it provides clear, concise solutions to a myriad of linguistic puzzles. What sets a dictionary of modern English usage apart is Fowler's distinctive blend of scholarly knowledge and approachability. Over time, it has evolved beyond being just a book. It stands as a testament to Fowler's lifelong dedication to the English language, a monument to his passion and precision. It has become an irreplaceable tool for writers, editors, and scholars globally thanks to its unique features. Fowler's impact stretches well beyond the realms of literature. His simple yet powerful principles of clarity, simplicity, and precision have significantly molded the way we understand and use the English language. His influence has touched even the most bustling newsrooms and prestigious halls of academia worldwide. Let's dive into some inspiring stories that illustrate his profound influence. One can hear the echo of Fowler's ideals in the works of noted figures like George Orwell and David Crystal, as they have openly acknowledged how Fowler's wisdom has inspired their own literary contributions. Fowler's insights, beautifully encapsulated in his numerous works, continue to resonate with a power that transcends time and place, inspiring generations of writers. They serve as proof of his unwavering commitment to the English language, a guiding light for those struggling with the intricacies of grammar, style, and usage. In the ever-changing world of language, the legacy of Henry Watson Fowler stands as a beacon, lighting the way towards clear and effective communication. His work is a shining reminder of the enduring power of words to inspire, to educate, and to connect us all, act us. Among the many pearls of wisdom that Fowler bestowed upon the world of linguistics, his five basic commandments shine brightly, serving as a guiding star for writers and language enthusiasts navigating the complex cosmos of the English language. With their remarkable simplicity and depth, they act as a compass guiding us towards clarity, precision, and accessibility. Fowler's first commandment speaks to the power of familiarity. He believed in the strength of words that echo with the majority, words that are firmly rooted in collective comprehension. The second commandment champions specificity, encouraging writers to create vivid images with their language, thus facilitating readers in capturing the essence of ideas with increased clarity. 
His third rule urges the use of individual words over circumlocution, aligning with his principle of simplicity and advocating for brevity in expression. The fourth commandment underlines the preference for shorter words, echoing Fowler's belief in and precision. His final commandment points towards the inherent potency and authenticity of Saxon words over Romance words, acknowledging the deep-seated roots of the English language. While these commandments may appear simple, their impact on the use of English is profound, rendering it more accessible, comprehensible, and effective. More than a set of rules, they represent Fowler's unwavering commitment to the beauty and precision of the English language, a dedication that continues to inspire and guide writers and readers alike. For anyone who seeks to conquer the English language, Fowler's commandments are not just guidelines, but the pillars upon which to build their linguistic mastery, a legacy of wisdom as timeless as the stars. Diving headfirst into Fowler's five linguistic secrets, we're about to take you on an incredible journey to bring these timeless principles to life in our modern English. Do you find yourself wondering, amidst the evolution of language and in the age of hashtags, how these principles still matter? The answer lies in Fowler's eternal wisdom. By choosing homey, familiar words instead of complex, obscure ones, we build a cozy bridge of connection and understanding with our audience, whether we're writing a business report or firing off a tweet. Opting for concrete words instead of abstract ones is like painting a vivid picture, allowing our readers to instantly grasp the core of our message, it in a best-selling novel or a quick email. The third secret, choosing one precise word over a long-winded phrase, is a nod to brevity. In our fast-paced world where time is of the essence, concise messaging packs a punch, whether in a crucial business proposal or a simple text message. The fourth principle, picking shorter words, is incredibly relevant in our digital age, where every character counts. Finally, Fowler's love for Saxon words over Romance words is an homage to the deep roots and rich tradition of the English language. Even in a world buzzing with emojis and hashtags, principles still hold their own, guiding us toward clarity, simplicity, and effectiveness in our communication. These aren't just rules, but brilliant guiding stars in the vast cosmos of linguistic expression, lighting our way as we journey through the beautiful complexities of English, from the past, into the present, and onward to the future.